All right, I had a hard time understanding the concept of template boards, so I wanted to share this with anybody else using the WeCan product. <coughs> okay, first of all, we need to create a template. Under board templates, under board templates, I'm going to start things off by creating a list of board templates is really what I'm doing here. Uh, my business is CompuMatter, so I'm just going to call it CompuMatter Board Templates. Okay? And under here, I'm going to create a new board, which I will call New Repair Clients. Now, there was some confusion in this process for me because previously um, I used, you know, I would have created my different list here. I would have expected this whole thing to be a board template, but this is how you do it. So I've created a new repair client board uh, underneath the board templates. I'm going to click on that and surprisingly, excuse me, click on this folder right here. And when you click on the folder, this is a new behavior. It creates a whole nother swim lane with a whole nother environment for you. So here I'm going to go ahead and create my traditional lists for to do, doing, done, uh, and I'm going to I'm going to just say pending parts, pending client reply. Okay, that's that's what we're using here at the store. All right, so that gives me what I need. I can now click back, uh, go back to all boards. If I want to look at templates, I can see that that's here. Not really sure what this means down here, these two circles, but it is for the repair one user. Uh, so these are user specific. From what I understand, we can't create them in a higher administrative capacity at this point. So I'm going to go back to the, my main board screen and add a new board <clears throat> and click on template. Now we can see what I've created here is visible, new repair clients, and this is supposed to be able to just be dragged right up here. Okay. Now I have found in Chrome, which is what I'm using here, it doesn't always work. It often fails. It's very tricky. You can spend a lot of time trying and not get in there. I've tried double clicking and dragging. So what I ended up doing is using Firefox. Firefox is completely predictable. Same behavior. Add, <clears throat> template, drag it up, boom, done. Give it a title, uh, and uh, I'll just call this Tom Jones, all right? And then I'll go back here. Oh, no, okay, so it looks like I have to hit the Enter key in order to make that stick. Yeah. No. There it isn't. Try this again. I'm just going to hit enter here. Okay, so hitting enter there made the bottom drop down disappear. If I hit enter again, still nothing. Hmm. Maybe if I start off by giving it a name. No, that doesn't matter. Maybe if I just close this now. Nope. Maybe if I search for it like this. No. Nope. Oh, that's interesting. So, all right, so let me delete this. And I'll delete it from the archive. So let's show you how we succeeded at getting that in there. Add <clears throat> template title. And here I just clicked on this. Yeah, I just clicked on it one time and it brought it in. Now you'll notice when I click on this client, I've got 
my different lists the way that I wanted them in the template. So that worked out perfectly. <clears throat> now let's take a look back in here in Chrome where I was having a problem before. See the idea, see this is a universal drag me symbol. So I, my initial reaction was to drag and it also turns into a plus sign which would indicate that's the correct behavior but nothing happens. If I click on it, it works just fine. So that's the behavior. I hope this helps somebody else uh, in creating board templates for use in WeCan.